So let's um, create a damageable next damageable dot h. I'll go to damageable, get rid of that. That's from before when I was delete. Yes. Okay, now let's create a damageable. <laughs> create new item, header file, damageable. All right, um, we'll do header guards, damageable h, which are impossible to do without them. I should switch to pragma now. It's too late for me. There's no pragma once for me. I don't know why. Okay, so now let's um, let's use it like we want, like we want to use it. <laughs> we want to know the center x and center y. So if iter second dot expired. So we have this expired method, which will tell us if the um, the weak pointer has been used up, doesn't exist, is deleted, etc. So as long as it's not expired, we can use it. So if iter, so we'll make a shared pointer. So boost shared pointer to damageable um, it'll be, let's call it um, damageable. That's a hard word to spell, but I'll use it anyway. And we can just pass it in iter second because that's the weak pointer. So we're constructing a shared pointer from a weak pointer. That's what we're doing right here. Because remember, weak pointer is too weak to actually do anything, and we want it to do something. So we're going to do iter first set position. Hopefully you guessed that, so that we can set the position of the iter based on the damageable's position. So we'll give it damageable um, center x and damageable center y. So let us add those to our damageable struct. So units of game, let's include units. And include center x. We'll make it virtual because this is going to be an interface. Equals zero and is const. Let's do the same thing for center y. And this should be happy. So let's build and make sure that this compiles. And it does. OK, so there's two more things I want to do. One, uh, the first one is to be able to add damage text to our damage text map. So let's make a method that will take in a damageable and add its damage text. So. This will mean a couple things, but I will get to them soon. So add damage a bowl. Let's call it that. Um, and it will take in a damageable. Let's make it a shared pointer to a damageable. And we'll call it damageable. And all it's going to do is add the damageable's damage text to the damage text map. Um, in order to do this, though, we need to make sure that damageable has a get damage text. So let's um, go to damageable.h and add this in here. So virtual um, boost shared pointer to damage text, which we should forward declare and include our shared pointer. Do that. And it's going to just be called get damage text. Uh, won't make it const. And all it's going to do is say damage text map. Sub damageable get damage text is equal to let's make a weak pointer from this damage text or from this damageable. So boost weak pointer. Sub 
damageable gets damageable. Um, yeah, so I think this should build. Get damage tax is not member of boost. Why is it not in the mirror? Oh, I see. Damageable is not as forward declared. Okay, my bad. Sorry, guys. Let's implement this in the CC file. How do you like me now? Great. Okay. Let's make our player class a damageable now. And our first cave bat a damageable. And there are a, are a few things we need to do. First of all, let's include damageable. Oh, cool. Player is a public damageable. And before I go any further, let's also implement a virtual destructor here. Virtual damageable with a tilde. Virtual damageable with a tilde equals zero. Pure. Beautiful. Implement it as inline damageable. Okay, not that I ever plan on implement. What's your problem? Ugh, I forgot parentheses, man. I'm not on my game today. I'm sorry. And I'm doing this stuff. Okay. We have a virtual destructor. Great. Now we can implement it. We're, I wouldn't ever delete a pointer to a damageable, but um, still deep, dark, damp corner. So the good news is we already have center X and center Y. All we need to do is implement our get damage text. Which is gonna be easy. Units, nope. Let's see if I already have it defined down here. Damage text. It looks like damage text needs to be turned into a boost shared pointer. So boost shared pointer to damage text. We'll call it damage text. And let's implement get damage text while we're still in our .h file. Right below center y. Where's center Y? Oh, uh, here. And all we're going to do is So now we need to go into our CC file for our player. Stop updating and drawing. Player updating drawing. We don't need to do anything with our damage text except for initialize it. And we'll do that in the constructor. We still need to be able to set damage. And that's it. So let's um Let's create a new one in our constructor. Where do we put it? Damage text. Um, right below timer. Uh, 
Okay. Building just to make sure that I didn't break anything. Everything's still working. And then we'll go into our game class and we'll um, create a proper, we'll create a proper damage texts class object. So game date CC. So let's include damage texts. And also we'll need to open .h because we'll need to change our player's type. So from scoped pointer to shared pointer. Do the same thing for the bat. Map can stay scoped pointer. And let's create a damage text. Um, we'll just pound include damage text, I guess. And have one down here at the bottom. Sorry, this should be damage text plural. And go into game CC and after we construct our player, we'll do damage texts dot add damageable, giving it our player. And let's update and draw our damage texts. Right below our timer. Yep, let's update in the update method. Okay, last time milliseconds. And finally, let's draw it. And we'll draw it right before the HUD. So build and run in, we should be able to see our damage checks for our player being updated. And then we can work on the bat next. That worked way better than I thought it would. Okay, sweet. So let's um, work on the bat.